the video today <laughs> was not one of my best videos and I apologize for that and I'm sorry for and uh, especially to Hannah she was a wealth of information and I learned a lot and I had a really good time I asked a lot of questions she answered them extremely well I was so caught up in the moment and having such a good time I didn't have the camera on when she was answering me half the time so I blew it but I'm gonna post this video anyway so you can see it was an experience. It was really cool, and I really enjoyed it. But I'm sorry, Hannah. I didn't mean to blow it so bad. As usual, my videography skills are relaxing. But we're over here at one property. And we just laid out a bucket. Oh, did I do that wrong? Okay. It's all right. Okay. So we've laid uh, one bucket in this trough, but I don't. I didn't realize she had another trough over there. She's called the cattle. We're we're feeling we're feeling the the water as they're coming up because they're ready to eat. They got a lot of green grass, but they're still ready to eat. Oh look, here comes some calves. Isn't that cool? And she's calling them. They're going, we know, we're ready. staying out here so I don't distract them too much because I know they're not used to me. Isn't he a handsome bull? back up. I want full attention. <laughs> We're here at the next place and they've got cats everywhere but they seem to be happy and reproducing we've tried to keep him as a bull we've kind of steered the rest of them oh yeah the boys we kept him back because he's just looking so good he's very stocky i don't know if you notice he's starting to get a little bit of a hump on his neck like a, like a bull oh yeah and that's we decided to keep him back. We're gonna get him tested to see if he's um, gonna be homogeneous with cold, and probably kind of gonna test if he's gonna be black as well, like dropping no horned calves and black calves. That's what Kevin likes. But we're gonna probably be, if he's good, we'll probably be taking him over to David's house, and I'll probably be selling my white one. But um, we're gonna be keeping him back as a bull and just kind of seeing what he's gonna be tested as. Okay. But um, he's one of the really good stocky looking bulls and he's, get, he's already getting really bullish at a young age, which is, can be kind of rare because some of them, I mean, some of them will look pretty good. And all the orange tags, by the way, are female and they're going to always oh. be the left ear. Okay. And he's got a white tag and right ear, so he's, that's one way to tell they're boys. Yeah. 
Blue tags, I don't think there's any, oh, well, there might be one or two. Blue tags are going to be our registered ones. <laughs> they look like they have various styles of earrings. <laughs> yes. Hi. And the ones, the tags without numbers on them, those are the fly tags. And they um, help control with the flight control on there. Oh, I didn't even know they had such a thing. Yeah, they help quite a bit. Hi, babies. Now we're up here at Cherokee Central on the corner up here and checking I guess it's the third location we didn't I showed you the last set of cow we were going to feed them but apparently her cousin or something has them on a different property it had them on the different field and we didn't need to mess with them so now we're on the third property and they're already hollering for the breakfast We're over here into a shaded spot. Should be helping. <laughs> <laughs>